Agreed but not cleared. Rwandan opposition activist Paul Rusa Sabagina has had his 25-year prison sentence commuted by presidential decree. The government maintains he is still, in the eyes of the law, guilty of terrorism. There is no doubt that criminal offences were committed. There's no doubt that the proper procedure was respected. And there's no doubt that Mr. Rusa Sabagina was convicted because he deserved it. On this point, there is no doubt. Rusa Sabagina inspired the Oscar-nominated film Hotel Rwanda based on his saving more than 1,000 people during the 1994 genocide of the country's Tutsis. His release comes after months of negotiations between the United States, where he had been living, and Rwanda. Rusa Sabagina's arrest in 2020 was criticised by the US and also Belgium, the latter of which he is a citizen. The decision to kidnap him, to put him on a private jet, to bring him by force back to Rwanda, shows that not even they believe in the legitimacy of the evidence against him. In 2021, Rusa Sabagina, a critic of Rwandan President Paul Kagame, was convicted of having links with the FLN, which Kigali considers to be a terrorist group. Rusa Sabagina, who had lived in exile since 1996, has admitted his membership of a political party, but denies any links to terrorist attacks by the FLN.